Oh, hey guys, you're watching? Okay, perfect. So, this time I'm working again with oil on a canvas. But it will be something different than the typical landscapes. It will still involve a landscape, but the focus will be on a barn owl. I mean, this is just an owl, but... Yeah, you get the point. So, instead of straight painting on the canvas, I'm gonna sketch it. And as the outlines are ready, let's move on to painting. You can see that this artwork was a bit different than what I usually paint as I haven't painted an animal before but it was a custom request and I decided why not to take the challenge and see what I could make about it. So I started with the sky which had to be really clear with the bright moon and the shining stars in it such as you cannot see it around the cities but only somewhere far away from the lights of the big towns and like everything else if we want to see the real the ever everlasting white we have to take a step back from the deceitful and fallacious one that we have surrounded ourselves with in order to indeed see it. As further in the distance the mountains were I had to make them with more like one cover and almost merging with the night sky and as closer as they get I used more vivid palette and started adding more details till the snowy peaks could be seen better and better reflecting the moonlight and making it look like it's their own. And while I'm moving to the foreground of the painting you can see how down in the valley the trees are showing up through the early fog created by the freezing river and starting forming this deep forest where the nest of that flying creature is probably hidden. And here is coming the most challenging part of the painting for which I wasn't absolutely sure that I will successfully make and just want to say thanks for the granted trust to the man who commissioned it, you know, he's probably watching 
and if he is not it means that he haven't liked the painting and that is really really bad I mean yeah whatever no it's actually not whatever I strongly hope that I have fulfilled his expectations and he absolutely like it strongly hope so Well, actually the hardest part of the barn all was making the first wing and after I made it somehow the rest of it was much easier. For example, I expected the face to take a lot of time and the truth is that it took me less than anything else and still it was a decent amount of time but it is hard to tell as I have speeded up the video like over 30,000 times or so otherwise it will be really long and I don't think that it will be interested to someone to watch. But if you are interested to see the not so much speeded up version, it will be uploaded on my Patreon page where you also can support me and get some rewards in return. And mainly I will be tremendously thankful if you can support me and time to those of you who are doing it, it just means so 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 much to me. And still I'm so thankful that you are watching my videos, it is just amazing to be able to create something and share it with the world. So thank you so much. there you have it I hope you liked it it was something different but they say it's always good to try something different so yeah thank you so much for watching I hope you enjoyed it and if so give it a thumbs up or whatever it is and if you haven't yet subscribe to my channel <coughs> if you have I really appreciate it I mean it's it will be pleasure for me if you subscribe as always, special thanks to my patrons for helping me to keep going and supporting me. I really appreciate it, guys. Thank you one more time for watching, and I will see you in the next video. Also, I'm not really consistent with these videos, and I think I will start maybe uploading every week. So, yeah, see you next week. Or the week after the next week. Yeah. Or really on the week after the... Whatever. See ya.